<clears throat> Hello, here are, th here are the text-dependent questions for um, the text that we just read, Panika's Favorite Season. You guys can go listen and reread re that and then use me reading out loud to help you answer this. You guys can access this in the packet or on your um, ELA um, uh, online. You can access this online in the ELA packet or your physical packet and just write down the answers or type them in. All right, so this says Wednesday, April 29th, Panika's favorite season. Use the passage, Panika's favorite season, to help you answer the following text-dependent questions. We're going to use our text to answer the questions. You guys are very good at this. All right, the title says text-dependent questions and answer. I will read you the questions now. What are the three Alaskan seasons in this selection? Go back to the text and find them. Find three and answer it over here. The other one is, which one is Panika's favorite? Write the answer. What have Panika's parents been waiting for? How can you tell they are excited about it? So that we're going to have to use some clues to figure out why we think they're excited about it. But right here, you guys, for this question, you guys should be able to find the answer and just copy the answer down. Use clues to answer this one. Here is the name that I cannot figure out how to pronounce. We'll try it again. What does Kiak, Kiak maybe? What does Kiak want to do? What does he want to do? Answer it here. And why does Mama think the kids in uh, Tok Toktna uh, would feel the same way as Kiak? <laughs> I'm trying my best here, guys. So why does Mama think the kids in their village feel the same way as um, her brother. <laughs> Answer it right here. All right. And how do the villagers get around? We went over that. Use our vocabulary words that we just learned. Why doesn't um, Pekna, why doesn't Pekna's village have any roads on land? Find the answer in the text, write it there. And then the last two questions in the last box. In the eighth paragraph, what does the word overflows most likely mean? Ooh, think of what, what definition, what context clues can you use? What can you replace with overflows and make it still make sense? Write those words here, okay? And how did you figure that out? Write the answer there. All right, so that is your text-dependent questions. Fill it out. 